John Hancock here and today I received a new homebrew in the mail for Nintendo Entertainment System and this is City Trouble. It's published by Mega Cat Studios and programmed by Den Cat Games and it comes complete in box. I'm going to show the packaging, check out the gameplay, let's do it! So here's what the complete in box package comes with and this particular package is 40 bucks they do sell a cart only option as well as a limited edition black cart and they use all new parts which is really nice you know I, I produce my own games on the side you know I, I don't program but I pub help publish and it's really nice to see new products coming out using all new parts and I know that there's a big controversy with using donor carts so this is a really nice package the box is it comes flattened so you have to fold it yourself which is fine um, it also has like it's like raised right there it's really nice really like glossy super nice finish that's that's collector quality box I'm really impressed with that also the manual the manual is really sweet full color I mean they went all out I mean this is really nice cool artwork really cool and even has the old school notes section <laughs> you could take notes in it. I think that's really neat too but yeah that's a really nice manual I'm jealous of that I've had a couple games it's like gosh that's a really nice manual and comes with sticker Mega Cat Studios alright on to gameplay alright here's City Trouble by Dencat Games I do want to note I found kind of a weird bug and so I don't know what what's happening but I tried playing this on the AVS and using a controller I could press start and I could load the game but then I couldn't control it with a controller and I you know tried the tried the port tried different controllers don't know what that's about but um, I am booting it up on the Retron HD which doesn't have as good as color palette as the AVS but it works and so that's what matters so this is city trouble and we press start it's really cool it's got some 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 voice audio in this game very cool and i like this it's kind of an everrunner game uh the gameplay to me kind of reminds me something reminiscent to like kung fu in a way where it's you kind of have enemies coming wave after wave of enemies coming you have to get to the end of the level there's a score um, again so you have a taser as a weapon and there's essentially three enemies on the first level and the combination so your taser recharges and you zap the enemies and different enemies give you different points the the one enemy in the air there is really annoying and but gives you the most points and so that's that's what's important and so again your taser slowly recharges but yeah the one in the air definitely gives you the most points you do have a health energy bar and it's uh see how far you can get i'm not the best at this game oh yeah i made that mad skills okay So that lady there gives you energy. Again, you can't let the end of the level, the, the scrolling level, you have to keep up with it or it'll, it'll, uh, it'll kill you. So, got a pretty good run here. I try to use my taser sparingly. Again, uh, it's, it's really just those aerial ones are the... Uh, they really hurt you though. If you, if you touch them, they, they really take a lot of energy off. But they give you the most points if you can zap them. All right, boss. So four fireballs. All right, get him in the back. Yeah. All right, so you got to jump over him, blast him. Okay, I got it. So 
The goal is, yeah, that's when you zap them. All right, got him. Take that. All right, level two. Different level, different enemy. Okay. Boy, those those are annoying. Female in the sky, whoo, wow, tough. All right, Let's see if I can do this now. Can't do that. <laughs> Let's get it on. All right, so there you have it. So there you have it. Kind of a throwback to an old school Nintendo game. I like action platformers, and so this is kind of cool. Also have a daughter, so having a female protagonist, is, she'll probably see this game and want to play it. I like it. So, what do you think of it? I'd love to hear from your comments below. Is this the type of game you'd like to play? Or do you like something else? Thank you so much to people around the world who've taken time out of their day to watch any of my videos. I'm still, yes still, currently doing three videos a week, uploading Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays at 8 o'clock a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. I also have a Patreon for as little as a dollar a month. You can donate and get an exclusive video. Thank you so much to the people around the world. My hat's off. This is the immortal John Hancock. Take care.